Okay, the reasons why marijuana should be legalized. Number one, I would think, I would hope that people come to grasp this as a, a main stay reason. The freedom of choice, as long as one is not wrongly infringing upon another. If someone consumes it on private property where they are not infringing upon another, that should be that, right? People have been imprisoned over the years for nonviolent actions such as this. It's just quite ridiculous, if you ask me. Obviously, in our society, we have the hypocrisy of alcohol and tobacco, um, those substances being legal while people are discriminated against. On the other end, there's also the extreme sports angle to take a look at. There are many activities in our society. If one claims that the reason why they are, you know, they want to enforce against marijuana or what have you, if it's because of public safety or something some reason you want to look out for the safety of the individual you need the big brother the government looking after the individual what about rock climbing bungee jumping skydiving I could list a whole slew of activities which are completely legal um, and much more life-threatening in most people's books if you ask the average person in the street would you rather do this or that I think most people are gonna to choose to smoke the marijuana cigarette sitting on their couch rather than going to do some of these life-threatening activities so I'm just trying to figure out, I guess, the reason why I bring that up. What is the reasoning behind people wanting to um, crack down on others for, for doing the substance? I can't come up with a reason. Uh, what about the individuals who have a valid medical reason? I can speak firsthand and say that, you know, cannabis uh, helps with nausea. So um, I get motion sickness often from flying or anything like that. So, um, you know, sometimes in via cars. So, um, when I get to the destination, it's nice to know that I can have something that can make me feel better. It's a valid spiritual and cultural reason that a lot of people may have. Uh, the connection to the environment, perhaps in some sort of sacrament type of way. Obviously, there's an extreme cost to our system. We're incarcerating and processing the, you know, innocent criminals as they would be called, the nonviolent consumers and producers. Um, meanwhile, there are rapists out walking on the streets, literally. So it's a total misappropriation of resources. If you I can explain uh, my real world cultural and spiritual connection in more detail than I do it here. I'm just going to mention it and just say that I, I have a strong uh, cultural and spiritual connection. Music, politics, life, thought, love. I feel marijuana has helped me become a better man. I have no proof on this any more than the association, you know, with marijuana. I have no proof that the association of marijuana in my life has helped me become a better man where I, I made some serious life changes as a result of the road that I was on. However, I would say that it, it appears that way to me. It could be like the plan of the plant. You know, in our society today, a parent often will um, either condone or decide for, you know, when a child becomes 21, maybe sometimes some parents sit down and say, hey, let's have a shot of whiskey. So what, what if a parent wants to sit down and consume some marijuana with a child? Is that inappropriate? Should the government decide um, what parents on that level should be teaching the children where, you know, like I said, where we're not infringing upon someone else or just the individual themselves is doing it. They're not hurting anybody else. Here's another angle to think about. What about pornography? You're telling me that young women age 21 and older, that is legal today, okay? So if you t you're telling me that that's legal and you want little, little, your daughter to go out and do that, or that's okay, your niece or whoever, and, and that's condoned by society, or and all that stuff, that's condoned, but yet someone can't sit there and smoke a marijuana cigarette. 
Now tell me that that's kind of strange. Now, just to be clear, I totally believe in in uh, you know the freedom of choice of pornography. That if those people choose to consensually engage in that, and they're not wrongfully attacking anyone and uh, it's just amongst themselves. It's all consensual. It's all good. They're above age. Then fine. So just to be clear, but I'm saying it is a quite a, a vast thing, right? You got a girl, you know, and and you're and you're selling that. Yet someone can't grow a plant and take that and sell it. I mean, is that Appropriate? Just for perspective. Understand that I clearly think that uh, smoking is dangerous. Whether you're smoking marijuana, tobacco, or apples, or wood, wood smoke, wood burning fireplaces, the exhaust from that is going to be dangerous for your body. Um, with marijuana, obviously, you can eat it. That is an alternative, and that is probably the major suggestion. Well, I hope this sheds some light on the matter, and maybe uh, you can think about decriminalization of marijuana. Thanks, sincerely.